This is the, an example of the resistance reflection rule where I'm trying to find the equivalent resistance located here at the emitter of Q2. So to do this, the first step would be to remove the transistors and draw it in the hybrid pi form. So all of the DC sources will be grounded And this was the base. So this is R pi one and VBE one and GM one VBE one. And over here, this becomes grounded because that was to VCC. And the base has the resistor in it now of R pi. This was the second transistor, so I'm going to call it R pi 2. And this is GM2 VBE2, where VBE is the voltage across this R pi 2. Down here we also need to ground this because it's a DC source, voltage source. I was told to ignore RO. So the equivalent resistance using the resistance reflection rule, I'm in the emitter of this transistor, so I need to look at all of the base resistors and divide them by beta plus one. By doing that, this is no longer seen in the circuit, so I'm going to erase that. Over here, as I go through here, these are still emitter resistors for this transistor. So that means that I need to reflect everything over here by dividing by beta plus one. That will then remove this transistor dependent source. Again, you can only remove these for the Thevenin. So our equivalent now, I'm going to take a pathway from here back to ground. So on this side, I have two splits. So I have this branch in parallel with this branch in parallel with this branch up here. So I'm going to first write the easiest one, which is R4. So our equivalent will be R4 in parallel with this branch over here. That branch, as I go through it, I have R3, so it's a plus, plus, plus. So it's R3 plus R pi 1 over beta plus 1 plus Rb, or R5 over beta plus 1. And that is that branch. And that's in parallel with the branch up here. As I go through this branch, I go through this transistor, or this resistor, so this is a plus. And then as I come here, these two split. So it's R pi 2 over beta plus 1 plus this in parallel with this. So that is R pi 2 divided by beta plus 1 plus R6 divided by beta plus 1 in parallel with R7 over beta plus 1. And that is the equivalent seen at the emitter side here.